Gazette notification on NPS 2021 issued very recently. This notification is for government employees who are covered under NPS scheme. It provides detailed procedure on enrollment to the NPS scheme till retirement benefits, accounting procedures, claims, etc. This video will be very helpful for the government employees covered under NPS and to the aspirants of various department exams. It is not possible to cover all the aspects in one video. We will be discussing about NPS 2021 in different series. So please watch all the series to get the complete knowledge about NPS 2021. NPS 2021 rule is called as Central Civil Service Implementation of National Pension System Rule 2021. I will repeat. Central Civil Services Implementation of National Pension System Rules 2021. NPS 2021 is not applicable to Railway Servants, Casual and Daily Rated Employees, Contingency Workers, Members of All India Services, Persons locally recruited for services in diplomatic consular to other Indian establishment in foreign countries employed in contract. Person whose terms and conditions of service are regulated by or under the provision of constitution or by any other law from time being in force. Person to whom central civil Service Pension Rule 1972 applies. That is, persons recruited before 1-1-2004. So, all these people, NPS 2021 rule doesn't apply. So, here, very important we have to notice is Railway Servants and All India Service also comes under this category. NPS 2021 gives some more important definitions. One among them is accredited bank. The accredited bank means simply remember it is a reserve bank. Accumulated pension corpus. It means monetary value of the pension investment accumulated in the individual pension account of a subscriber. Annuity Annuity means a periodic payment by the annuity service provider to the subscriber on purchase of annuity plan out of the accumulated pension corpus. Let us understand once again. Annuity means a periodic payment by the annuity service provider to the subscriber on purchase of annuity plan out of the accumulated pension corpus. Annuity service provider The annuity service provider is a life insurance company registered and regulated by the Insurance Regulatory and Development Authority and empaneled by the authority for providing annuity service to the subscribers of a national pension system. Authority Authority in NPS 2021 refers to Pension Fund Regulatory and Development Authority. Central Record Keeping Agency A Central Record Keeping Agency is an agency registered under Section 27 of Pension Fund Regulatory and Development Authority Act 2013 to perform the functions of record keeping, accounting, administration and customer service for subscriber to schemes. Drawing and Disbursing Officer 
the head of the office and also any other guested officer so designated by the department of central government uh, head of the department or administrator to draw bills and make payment on behalf of the central government the term shall also include the head of the department or an administrator where he himself discharge such function in post office we can compare it with ho postmaster who has the powers of functioning as drawing and dispersing officer check drawing and dispersing officer a check drawing and dispersing officer is also a drawing and dispersing officer who is authorized to withdraw money for specified types of payments against an assignment account opened in his favor in a specified branch of an accredited bank the definitions are little bit difficult to understand and grasp so please read again and again so that you can understand the definitions which will be very much helpful for your exam point of view and also to understand the entire rules defense services it will be easy uh, services under the government of india in the ministry of defense and in the defense accounts department under the control of ministry of defense paid out of the defense service estimate so defense service it is a defense service that's all this is one of the most important definition emoluments how to arrive at emoluments the expression emoluments involves basic pay non practicing allowance and da for a given calendar month non practicing allowance applicable only for a medical officers so basically it is a basic pay plus allowance foreign service it is also very important definition foreign service it doesn't means the person working in foreign countries foreign service means the person receives his pay other than the consolidated fund of india or the consolidated fund of state or the consolidated fund of unit territory individual pension account individual pension account is nothing but a account created for a subscriber under nps local fund administered by government the fund administered by the body which by law or rule having the force of law comes under the control of government and over whose expenditure the government retains complete and direct control that called as local fund administered by government national pension system means the contributory pension system referred to in section 20 of pension fund regulatory and development authority act 2013 whereby contribution from a subscribers are collected and accumulated in the individual pension account using a system of point of presence a central record keeping agency and pension fund as may be specified by regulation by pension fund regulatory and development authority in respect of point of presence central record keeping agency will be coming back again different agencies involved in nps
trained account officer an officer whatever is official designation who maintains the account of ministry department or office of the central government or union territory and includes an accountant general who is entrusted with the function of maintaining the accounts or part of accounts of the central government or union territory like example our dap pension fund pension fund is a fund which is given by the authority as a pension fund for receiving contributions accumulating them and making payment to the subscriber in the manner as may be specified by the regulations permanent retirement account number also called as pran a unique identification number allotted to each subscriber by central record keeping agency subscriber a government servant who subscribes to the scheme of pension fund is called as a subscriber trustee bank a banking company as defined in a banking regulation act 1949 so regarding what is trustee bank what is record keeping agency uh, what is point of presence so we are going to discuss in next series so far we have went through this 19 important definitions in nps 2021 however it is very difficult uh, to remember all these definitions because of the difficult terminologies used please go through the definitions again and again so that you can understand the definition and it will be very very helpful for you to understand the entire nps 2021 okay please wait for next series where we will be explaining in detail